Joel Hickerson, Grindog.com. We're going to draw a monkey in a tree. The first thing we're going to draw is the monkey because we want to make sure we don't push him off the page with the tree. So the monkey, we're going to map out a little space for our monkey. Start with the uh, body, which is the biggest part. A little circle for his belly, a little circle for his muzzle, a smaller circle for his head, and some ears, and the arm going straight up. Uh, maybe the other arm over here holding a banana. Okay, feet up. So it looks like he's up off the ground. And then we worry about the tree. Okay, the tree's trunk would come straight down, may even go off the page. And the tree itself, we're going to cover with leaves. Okay, again, these are construction elements. So when we come back with a finished drawing to, to, uh, do our finished piece, these lines really don't matter, okay? We may change them. So let's finish our monkey with some eyes, maybe a smile. Happy guy, he's eating a banana. His arms, lots of lines for the trunk, maybe a few more leaves. Come back with our marker and now we're going to do the finished work. So we're going to loosely use our construction lines and do our tree. Kind of leaf, sh leaf shapes but very loose leaf shapes. If you get caught up in the details this it, well, it, it kind of takes away from the work and uh, also takes you a lot longer. Okay so we got the monkey's arm. There's no there's smile we got the muzzle, eyes. We've got his eyes in a configuration where he's actually looking out at the viewer. Maybe some hair. And one element that makes a monkey a monkey is the ears. If you exaggerate the ears, automatically people will guess that, that you're dealing with a monkey here. All right, monkey has a little round belly. Legs, again, don't get caught up in the details. This is a cartoon, so it's an exaggeration. But you also want to keep uh, focus on the most important elements, which is him hanging, the attention in the arm going up into the tree on a branch. Also another thing that's going to make this guy a monkey is the fact that he's holding a banana. So you peel your banana, maybe even take a little bite out of it, come back around, give him a little belly button. Make the tree a tree, and a tree, everybody knows, always has a, a hollow trunk and a little hole in it for a squirrel. So maybe put a couple leaves around the tree. Little motion lines for the monkey. And then you come back, you get your eraser, and if you've done your job and drawn very lightly with your construction lines, it should be very easy to erase the lines that you don't need anymore. And when you've erased these lines, you can look back at your drawing to see what you've forgotten. You may want to put some bark lines on your tree, or you might want to give monkey a little more hair, a little more of a head. A little gravity to its features. And there. And that's a monkey in a tree.